Hey, what's going on guys? Today's video is all about shooting and specifically how to curl or how to curve a ball with the inside of your foot. In this video, I'm gonna give you some helpful tips. However, if you want to improve your shooting, if you want to improve any skill, it's all about putting in the time, the effort, and getting the repetitions. The more you practice, the better you're going to get, but only if you learn to analyze your technique. And what I mean by that is when you have a bad shot, don't just be frustrated. Ask yourself, why was it bad? What do I need to change about my technique to generate the shot that I want? The same thing goes for when you have a good shot. Ask yourself, why was that a good shot? What did I do correctly? And what do I need to keep doing in the future? Now saying that, let's get you some helpful tips to help you improve your technique right away. Number one, get your body over the ball. This goes for any type of shooting. It's so important. If you want to produce a shot with power that stays on target, you need to get your body over the ball. So do not lean back, do not lunge for your shots. If you do, you need to take all the power off of it because it's probably not going to stay on target. The next thing I want you to focus on is your foot technique. So even though you're not using your laces, you're opening your foot up, you still need a strong flex foot. If you have a weak foot, you are going to have a weak shot. And one thing I've really been working on lately is landing on my shooting foot. So as you can see, I'm hitting the ball, I'm almost jumping in the air, and I'm landing on my shooting foot. This is really helping me get more whip and dip on the ball and allowing me to keep it on target. So let's look right at foot technique. As you can see, I'm opening my foot and I'm using the inside of my big toe. I'm trying to hit the outside of the ball and produce some curve on the ball. It should be spinning when you make contact. Now, if I hit the ball in the center, it's not going to spin. It's probably just going to dip or rise. If I'm hitting the ball on the outside, it's going to produce that curve that spin on the ball it's going to allow you to put the ball outside of the net and have it come back on target but as i talked about you want a strong flex foot you want to meet the big your big toe the inside of your big toe to the outside of the ball and think about pushing through the ball not just chopping your shot but pushing through the ball to create good spin and in the end, it all comes down to practice. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Here are a couple shots that we took in our little training routine. We shot for about 20 minutes and we just played little combinations and worked on curling the ball into different corners. So thanks for watching the videos, guys. Please like, please comment, share, subscribe. If you have any questions, just comment below and I'll do my best to help you with your technique. I'll talk. I'll talk to you tomorrow.